<clears throat> Hello, I'm over here, producer. We do have a show to do, you know. I know it's lovely Halloween and everything, but yes, I know it's still Halloween. Well, it's a couple of days before Halloween. So hello and welcome to Retro 70s Kid. Tonight we're doing another Bratz episode, yes I know, but I've got a huge amount of Bratz followers out there, so I have to keep doing them. So tonight we're doing the 2008 Amazing, and that's the word you're going to hear a lot tonight, and another word you're going to hear a lot tonight are details. The 2008 Bratz World Folding House. Um, that's the front, it's actually this big, it folds right up. Um, you may see that at the end, you may not. Um, I'll have a look at the detail at the front. I like the more realistic colouring. And these beautiful drawers. And that actually folds up there. And it's huge. I meant to measure it, but I forgot. But I don't know. How long is that, do you think, producer? About a meter. It's huge, but it does fold up to that hot much in that thick little box. But look at that. Now, when I showed my three story Bratz high rise pad, which is back in episode show you just down here I was no not that one it was the two-story Bratz mansion sorry and we'll show you which episode that is there it's a really good episode but I was complaining a bit about how detailed the outside was and how plain the inside was and I use this as an example is of you can do a beautiful outside and look at the detail on the inside look at these on the top cables flat screen Beautiful fireplace and other more wall details. Now the only bit of furniture I got this what that came with it was the couch. I didn't get any of the other furniture I've improvised with other stuff. But it goes around to this incredible kitchen. Now the oven door opens and the fridge opens. Can you get into that? But no, the cabinets don't open, but the, the oven does, and the fridge does. So you can put a really skinny baking pan in there. <laughs> and the house tonight has the Bratz 2002 to 2008 Slumber Party Girls. So they're all in their pyjamas, having a bit of a slumber party just before Halloween, and they're about to carve a pumpkin for Halloween which is approaching rather quickly. And so I've added a coffee table with food and a candelabra. That coffee table is just like a dollar something from China with free postage. Oh yeah, it's like the candelabra behind me, kind of. A spooky candelabra. And just uh, some extras I've got here. That's a Bratz phone, Bratz cushions, of course. Um, I think that might be the original table. I think. And actually, I'll go around to the right here to show you the bathroom. Now with this house, you could get extra add-on sets. You'd get a beautiful bathroom set, which came with a bathtub and a couple of other little things. And you could also get an extra bedroom set as well. But I didn't have those, so this is, but it's basic enough, beautiful enough as it is. The toilet, this lovely shower with the, um, glass look screen and the accessories little toothpaste and toothbrush and comb and hairdryer little duck squeeze bottle but if you if you if the kid was or, or the the adult collector was spread out on the floor with all this you'd have plenty of room for that extra bathroom set and the bedroom set and whatever I like there may have been a dining set I can't remember and then over here to the bedroom um, this is actually the I think the 2002 2003 original slumber party bed with the cushions and these are again the slumber party girls 
these aren't brats. That's a jewelry case, jewelry box, and uh, that's I think another jewelry box, but it works really well. All the accessories and this beautiful built-in cabinet, bookcase, whatever it is. I just live in a house full of these built-in bookcases. I so miss it. I think, however, I miss the swans the most. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so yeah. So um, with a bit of added extra furniture, it can come up beautifully. I only paid ten dollars for this, and I think it's time to sell it on now because it's too big for me to keep displayed up, and it's always packed up. So uh, someone will enjoy this. And also, when I went to the car boot the other on Sunday. I picked up this Bratz bedspread, uh, single doona cover, for a dollar. So I thought that'd be great to do when I do brat shows. Another rotation. So now I've shown how many I've had the uh, three Bratz houses I've shown you: the Bratz mansion, the three-story sky rise pad, and now the Bratz folding house. And again, amazing sets with incredible detail, MGA, and again they're not going to do stuff like this again, in realistic colours anyway. So if you have any questions, leave your questions in the comments below, and coming up, in my last episode, episode 38, I did my very first DIY, and I did the Halloween a Halloween haunted house which lights up being this one here now I'm going to show you a little add-on I did to, he did to hide the battery pack so I'm just going to clear this away and we'll be right back so the last video I up, we uploaded was a special DIY episode where I did this haunted house made out of cardboard and basic craft supplies um, it was 98% finished, so I've just gone ahead and finished a little few touches and added a bit to cover where the battery pack goes. So basically what I've done is just put dirt on the ground and more twigs and things, a bit more on the roof. A tiny bit more cobwebbing. Now when it comes to the side here, this was blank, so what I've done, I've I found the other day we were doing up the lanai getting ready for Christmas and summer and Gardner found this old car from a 1920s if not beforehand car which is not old antique or vintage or anything it's probably I don't know it's pretty modern but it was pretty beat up so I thought it's almost pretty good scale for this so I have put that in glued it in messed it up a bit and if I need to get to the batteries I simply take that off and I can get to the battery pack. So that's just a little extension I did to make it a little bit better. And you can hardly tell. There we go. So that's it. So yeah, so I just wanted to show you the com absolute complete product now. So uh, that's now ready for Halloween. Uh, hello. Mamacita, oh. I almost had to wait. No, no. We are filming. All right. <laughs> I've got a coffee somewhere. Could you bring it, please? Of course. Thank you. While we're late. Because it's part of my DNA. <laughs> <laughs> She's not wrong. All right, that's it. Thank you very much. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Go back and have a look at my Halloween. Yes, you've missed out. Have a look at my Halloween shows. And thank you. And if you watch till the very end, thank you very much. And good night.